Israel is still counting the bodies of those killed in Saturday's attack and fending off further infiltrations. More Israelis were killed in the attack than in during the entire Second Intifada between 2000 and 2005. It's a major blow to the country and to the image of Israel as a nearly impenetrable regional superpower. The consensus among Israeli leaders, and I suspect the public as well, is that Hamas not only needs to pay a heavy price, but that it cannot remain intact, and it appears to currently have Western backing for that. Israel is already preparing for a major invasion that could lead to Israel's prolonged presence in the Gaza Strip, but it does have several fronts to contend with, and the price civilians on both sides will pay, and all are already paying, especially in Gaza, is already very high. The question is, what will happen the day after? Will Israel, as well as the US, be forced to reassess their approach and prioritize instead of sideline the Palestinians, or go back to the status quo ante of managing and ultimately perpetuating this conflict?